vehicle or behind a barrier and someone gets injured. Service members from all branches of the military met at Fort Bliss, Texas to take part in this year's Operational Contracting Support Joint Exercise. The troops appreciated the realistic medical training portion of the exercise. I would not have the opportunity to generally get this uh, for my home unit. It's very interesting, much more um, thorough than I initially thought that it would be, which is great because when I get deployed, um, I think it's invaluable to know these, these skills. Some of the training from the exercise focused on scenarios that would help them adapt to situations while deployed. It's doing, uh, it's doing a great uh, job in preparing me for uh, deploying. I'm set to deploy here in the next couple of months. Feeling great about that, uh, working hand in hand with some great people, all different levels of experience, and I'm feeling absolutely fantastic about it. The exercise brought together military contracting specialists from all of the armed services for training on deployment and natural disaster relief efforts. Army Sergeant Kerry Collier, 16th MPAD, Fort Bliss, Texas. <laughs> there you go. Oh, it's too fast.